Good morning, you guys. Marissa Myers here. Happy Flex Friday. Today is day 24 of quarter force. 24 out of 30. I made it, and I actually did almost the workouts every single day, except I did skip one, so I'm one day behind. One day out of 30. That's pretty darn good for me. Uh, today's combination has a really awesome move called the Superman Punch at the end. I haven't really completely mastered it, so bear with me. But if you want to join me on this round, feel or on this three-minute round, feel free to do so. But make sure that you warm up first, and don't forget to keep posting your videos on Twitter or Instagram at your chance to win $1,000 daily for your video and hashtag quarter force, hashtag contest. It's for uh, going hard. They want to see you go hard. So push yourself hard, post those videos, hashtag quarter force, and hashtag contest. Here we go. Hey, Whoops. See if we can get this in there. You know there's a jump cross. Check. And then load the punch. Come at me, bro. On the toes. Three, two, one. Jump cross. Check. And then load the punch. Aim for the head. Jump cross. Boom. Aim for the head. Jump cross. You know what? Back. Sorry. Move this up a little bit because I don't think you can see it.
you're joining me. If you're joining me tonight, I mean today. Woo! Doggy. I went as fast as I could possibly go. So I'm getting some messages from some of my challengers that they don't feel that this workout is challenging enough for them. So I'm gonna just talk about that for a second. Uh, you can make this workout as beginner, sorry, beginner, intermediate, or advanced as you like. I was in great shape when I started this program and it is kicking my butt, but I push myself hard in the workouts. I don't just go, oh, okay, you know, and I don't play with my dog while I'm working out. I don't attend to my kids. I know that some of you have to, but maybe you could put them in a little play chair or something where they have something they can bounce around or a little playpen or put them in something that's enclosed so they'll just stay in that space while you work out because this workout needs your attention. You're not gonna get the results if you're just kind of like punching and kicking and dancing a little bit. You've gotta punch hard, boom, boom, knee, boom. You've gotta push yourself in this program to get the results that you want. I know for sure I can see my muscle definition is improving from this program. My core is improving, I'm sorry, my core definition is proving, improving from this program. I'm not trying to lose weight. I don't need to lose weight. I am just trying to complete 30 days of this and I would love to have some increased strength and cardiovascular conditioning, which is what it's doing for me. This is a total body conditioning program. If you're used to lifting weights, no problem. You're still gonna do weight, you're still gonna use your body weight and you're gonna train all of those muscles. You're going to be sore, but you've gotta push yourself. So if you're not feeling like it's hard enough for you, you're not pushing yourself hard enough. Push yourself harder in the punches and the kicks when you get them down and push yourself harder in those spikes. That's what they're there for. Do 30 seconds all out. And then when you get back to the elbow knee combination, then you can go back to learning the moves. I hope that's helpful for you. And I hope you're kicking this workout's butt. Thank you guys so much for watching my journey along the way. I hope you joined me for that three minutes and you kicked butt. See you guys later.